In this video, we are going to calibrate a nano pano with a leaf shutter lens. Um, this is so you can combine any sort of leaf shutter, Copal Zero, Copal, uh, sorry, Seiko Zero, Compor Zero, uh, anything of that nature. You can slap it right onto the nano pano. Um, this will show you how to calibrate it for infinity to get you started. Um, and then you can go from there figuring out your distances um, for your lens. So I'm going to go over what's included in the kit, which is over on this side, and then I'll talk about the tools that you will need for this process. So obviously we've got our nano pano, we've got a cone that'll take a M65 helicoid, and on top of this M65 helicoid, we have a lens board, um, and then there's a TPU focus ring with, for some lenses, um, I already have the distances marked. Um, this is not applicable for this lens, this is just another one that I had from a... Uh, different lens but the concept is the same um, for some of you you will receive one that just has evenly spaced distance markers all the way around with no numbers only infinity and um, that's just so you can pencil in or write in ink in however you're going to do that um, your distances once you um, bring it out and put in once it's calibrated infinity you would take it out onto a tripod and then calculate your distances um, but that will not be covered in this video. I'm just going to show you how to calibrate for infinity focus. All right, also included in the kit, you'll have lens shims. So depending on where you're at, you're going to need to increase the height. Um, I made these intentionally a little bit shorter so that you will need at least one or two lens shims to bring you up to infinity. And um, that's just because I don't know what your tolerances are on your lenses. And I'm not too familiar with the lenses to know if they're all exactly factory flange focal distance um, like other system lenses are um, and I know there's variations in shutters too so I get that could be tricky um, so I didn't want to mess with any of that so I just said hey well you know we'll just make these a little bit undersized so that you need shims but at the end of the day you can always uh, if you have a printer you can always reprint this or or match this to what you need so that you don't always have to use the shims um, and then uh, the last thing that we've got here is a little focusing screen that I made that just drops right into the nano panel to help you uh, com compose uh, or figure out where you're at in terms of infinity. Over on this side, uh, you're going to need uh, some form of camera that is calibrated to infinity or that at least you know you can confirm that has an accurate infinity focus. Uh, this is my personal MX which I've CLA'd before so I know that it's pretty accurate. Um, and I know that since I take a lot of landscape shots with it, um, I know those are always nice and crispy so I'm going to trust that camera to get my reading. Um, then you'll need some sort of LED panel light uh, or some sort of light source. You can use your phone. That's a good thing about this process. Just put it on a bright white screen um, and you can use your phone instead of this light panel. Um, obviously, we've got our lens and our uh, retainer ring. And then you will need a caliper, uh, ideally, so that you can measure how far off you are. You don't need the caliper. You would just do a lot more trial and error. Um, but the caliper makes it really easy to get this done and over with uh, on, in one or two tries. So now let's start by building the lens. Uh, so what I recommend is, uh, since these are plastic threads, you want to be very delicate with them. And then once you have the helicoid on there, I would just permanently leave it on there. Don't unscrew it. Just one less failure point to deal with. Um, but the way I like doing is similarly to how I showed you with the tripod bushings is you wanna go actually the opposite way first so that you know that it's properly seated and you'll feel it when it hits that point and then you'll know that you can then turn okay so once it's in I give it a nice slug kind of partial tightening um, so if I move it with my fingers just two or three fingers I know I can't really turn it anymore. That's probably about as much strength as you want to put on it. Don't do a full, you know, force of it or you'll strip it because again, they are just plastic threads. Um, if you wanted to, you can crazy glue it together. It's just so it's nice and solid and you don't have the chance of it just ripping all out in case of an accident. Obviously though, if you drop the camera, um, you've got a lot more things to worry about than just plastic threads. Um, you'll probably mash up something on the lens anyway. But anyway, that's that part um, and then we'll go ahead and throw the lens board on them already and if you notice there's some little teeth 
on the lens board and what is that for well there are some lenses like this one over here on the side this uh this is a 65 millimeter tlr lens some lenses have little posts in the back that are used to kind of locate onto uh, a lens board um, align they're sorry their alignment really um, an alignment tool to align the lens onto your lens board um, you can remove that because it'll have a flathead uh, slot there that you can use to take it off but if you don't want to do that um, that's what that's for and it actually helps you keep it kind of aligned as well too on this lens board so there's plenty of options once you're done calibrating it you'll put the lens on um, and align it properly so that it's in the orientation that you need it for your shutter button to be over on your index finger side um, but yeah that's what that's for in case anybody is wondering uh, but again you don't need to worry about that if your lens doesn't have one of those little posts or if you decide you're just going to remove it because you don't want to deal with that so again here i'm going to thread the other way and i had a little trouble with the helicoid because um, i was doing it while looking at the camera this one i'm just going to look at the, <laughs> the lens board but yeah, and it's in there. Same same reasoning here. I just use two fingers to tighten it because that should be enough strength, right? And when you pull on the shutter or the, the cocking hammer, um, it should not move. But if it does, just tighten a little bit more. Um, but it should not be super tight with anything on plastic. Um, don't over tighten it or you'll break or crack something. All right, so once that is ready, we are ready to get started. So let's move some things out of the way here. And what you'll do is you'll turn on, turn on your light. You'll get your camera body and little ground glass focusing screen. And you'll see that there's like a thicker area and a thinner area. You basically align that with the film gate there. And this, the TPU, you wanna make sure that the frosted side is downward. Um, and I added a little bit of gap there so that the frame doesn't interfere with the frosted, uh, this is acrylic actually, um, touching right onto how the film plane, where the film, film plane is. Um, so once you do that, you put it on top of your light source. Um, oh, it's something else that I did on this one. Uh, I don't know if you could see it. Let's remove the light. I made little pencil marks in there. Um, a little grid pattern with a bullseye so I can see those align when I check the sharpness. Um, unfortunately, I cannot show you. I already tried a few times um, showing you what that window looks like. Uh, with this camera, it, didn't, it doesn't quite get dark enough so you can see it. It stays all washed out with the exposure. Uh, but um, that helps you um, align it a whole lot better once you see the picture in there. And if I have a screenshot, I think I'll put a screenshot on the scene on the screen so you'll see what that looks like. Um, so ideally you want to have the lens cone already installed so that you know that there's no extra gaps from just the lack of it seating properly. I'm just doing this for training reasons. So you want to make sure that you already have the lens cone bolted on and that way there's no variations there. And then once you do that, you don't need to install the lens onto the lens board. You could just really drop it right on top. Um, if you're doing this carefully, obviously, make sure you don't drop that lens. Um, if you want to be secure, you could lock it in place. That's up to you. But I'm doing this quick and dirty here. So this is how we roll. Um, so then you want to make sure that this helicoid is at infinity. It's all the way down. All right. So what I'll first do here is I'll take my caliper and make sure that it's zeroed out. And I'm gonna take a measurement basically from, let me turn this, let me take the lens off. I am measuring from the surface up here to, I use a blue cone so I could show you, but basically where the cone starts. So, the, so it would be the blue surface down here below the helicoid. Um, you could take any reference measurement you want from anywhere. That's just what I find easiest on this setup. So I'm going to find out what that is. And that is 
measure a couple times, 27.64, 27.62, 27.63, 27.64, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63, 27.63,
but we're going to try it out anyway. And, and then we'll decide, okay, was it too far from infinity? Do they really need this? Um, you're going to measure by your results. So what you do here is you'll take off your lens board and you'll add the shim here and the thread. I need to start looking at the thing instead of looking at the camera. Um, and then you'll pop that back on. Again, I only like tightening with two fingers instead of the whole hand, just so it's not su super over tightened. Um, and then you would repeat the same thing. Drop the camera back to infinity and look through to verify while you're moving the focus back and forth to see if you've nailed infinity. All right, let me double check off camera real quick. All right, that seems to have worked. And now we have a lens that is properly calibrated to infinity. We did not have to take it outside and use a loop to figure out off of a subject far away if it is sharp. Um, that's pretty tricky. Um, I've had multiple variations of measurements when I've done it that way. Um, this way is probably as close as you're going to get, as accurate that you're going to get, um, with pretty good immediate uh, visual a confirmation of whether or not your infinity put focus. So this is specifically called the collimation or collimator uh, method. Um, if you want to know, um, I'll put a link to where I got the idea from originally. Um, but yeah, use that method for all of your other builds. Um, it'll work basically the same way um, as for as long as you can get a ground glass flat onto where the film plane is supposed to go. Oh, the last thing to mention here is the included focus ring. Um, I made it this way with the measurements on this ring. It works out a lot better instead of, as you can see here for another lens, I, I wrote it right in here. Uh, because now look at, because of the new shim, this is my top center point. But now my focus measurements are all on this side. And this is infinity way over here. Um, so to avoid that, then now that you know that this is your new top, you just slip your ring on and align that to infinity. And now you know that's where your infinity is. And then that's the, your close focus. And that's the way that's supposed to work. If you've got any questions, drop them in the comments below. Uh, but anyway, enjoy your nano pano and until next time. Bye.